everybody. It's Jess here with Lush Jess. Thank you so much for watching another What I Packed My Kids for Lunch. These lunches are not fancy, y'all. They are very simple, easy things I make for my kids. They may look fancy just because I have these bento box. These save me so much time because there's no other packaging. You just throw stuff in the individual compartments and you're done. It's really, really easy. It's easy for them to eat. Every single day, I'll show you what I pack them and when they get home, how much they ate. So today is Monday. Kids are headed back to school. So let me show you what they have. I have a nine-year-old and a seven-year-old. Um, today is cat in the hat day. So yeah. So let me show you what they have real quick. Here is Nate's. So for him, he has some pizza. We had some leftover pizza from Papa John's yesterday. And that's okay. Two pieces cooked in the air fryer just till it was warmed through. He's got a sausage and a cheese. He's got some cheddar cheese Pringles, some strawberries, and some alphabet cookies. He's got a milk to go with that. And then for snack today, he's got some Doritos and a Kool-Aid jammer. For Lucy, she's got some ham rolls, some red peppers, some cheddar cheese Pringles, and then both of these are trick cereal. She's got her juice to go with her lunch, and then she likes to take her bottle full of water to keep at her desk, and then she also has some Doritos for lunch. So this is what they have today, and we'll see you guys back when they get home, and we'll see how they did. As the kids are home from school, let's see how they did. Whoa. <laughs> Nate did not eat all of this. I really packed it full. There was two pieces of large pieces cut up in there. And then he had his strawberries and then he ate some of his chips, but not all of them. Maybe, maybe not hardly any of them. And he ate a few of the cookies. So not too bad. He's still got a lot of milk too. So he can have this for snack. Let's see, Lucy. She did good. She just got a couple pieces of ham left. So I'll take it. We'll see you guys back tomorrow for Tuesday. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Tuesday. Sorry for the loudness in the background. Welcome. Let's see what the kids have today. So I kind of did some different stuff with their lunch boxes. I gave Lucy this bigger Bentgo Fresh box and Nate has this Yum box. This one has a much bigger opening, so I was able to fit way more chicken in here. And then this one is deeper, so her taco wraps that she calls just fit better. So I have the Bentgo Kids and then I have one Yum box and one Bentgo Fresh. Um, this thing actually slides out so you can put a whole sandwich there. You can also put a sandwich here. So if your kids like sandwiches, there's some different options. Um, for Nate today, I did chicken in the air fryer. These are just some chicken nuggets. These will not be hot at lunchtime, but he doesn't normally mind. He's got some ketchup to dip, some strawberries, and some potato chips. He's got his milk to drink with his lunch. And then for snack, he's got some cheese crackers and a Kool-Aid jammer. Lucy has what she calls Taco Tuesdays. I don't know why she calls these tacos. She makes like little wraps. I take some scissors and I don't worry about it being perfect, but I cut little circles out of tortillas. And then she wraps them with pepperoni and lettuce. Hopefully they don't shift around too much in there. I don't think they will. She's got some veggies here, some carrots and some peppers. She's got strawberries and potato chips. She's got a water for her desk. She likes to drink her Kool-Aid jammer with her lunch. So she has the Sharkleberry Fin. And then she's got some mini Chips Ahoy for snack. So this is what she has today. We'll see you guys back when they get home to see how they did. All right, friends. The kids are home from school. Let's see how they did. Here's Lucy's. So she still has a little bit of lettuce, a little bit of pepperoni, but most everything else is gone. A couple stragglers and Nate. Nate ate everything, and that was a lot of chicken. So I liked being able to pack more right there. Um, so that was good. We'll see you guys back tomorrow. Yep, tomorrow. <laughs> to see how they do and to see what I pack. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Wednesday. Um, let me show you what the kids have today. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, if you hear that noise in the background, Nate's hanging out in here with his um, Chromebook. So we're trying something new with Nate. Uh, I, I did these a long time ago and it never went over super well, but he's been doing so great at school. We're trying a quesadilla. So I know these won't be hot till lunch. We have tried in the past like wrapping them in foil or putting them in a thermos wrapped in foil. Um, he doesn't like that at all because it, they kind of get soft. He likes them very crispy. So I'm hoping that he'll eat them even though they're gonna be more room temperature. 
but I just toasted up, you know, a quesadilla with some cheddar cheese, cut it into little bite-sized pieces, and that's what he has with some potato chips, Oreo thins, and strawberries. He's got his milk to drink, and then he's got his Kool-Aid jammer and Doritos for snack. Over here for Lucy, she's got a very snacky lunch, some pepperoni, some cut up cucumbers, a like clementine cutie orange. I peeled that for her. Just, they don't have a lot of time for lunch, so anything I can do to make it easier for them. Um, these are some iced animal cookies. She's got some barbecue Pringles and a little Hershey Kiss for dessert. She's got her water for her desk. I'll stick the juice with her lunch. And then she has Doritos for snack as well. So fingers crossed, we'll see how it goes, um, and I'll see you guys back when they get home. All right, you guys, the kids are home from school. Just a little heads up, though. I did get a text that Nate wasn't feeling great, or they thought maybe he wasn't feeling great. Um, he didn't have a fever, so they didn't send him home, and he didn't want to come home. So I'm not sure how much he ate, but they said he wasn't. He was kind of not in the best spirits. So all that to say, this still could be good. I don't know. Y'all, I didn't even have to preface that. He ate the quesadilla. I am so proud of him. That is awesome. Like I said, it's not warm, but at least it doesn't get soggy when you do it like that. Um, if your kids don't mind soggy, you could totally wrap it in foil or wrap it in foil and put it in a hot thermos. My kids don't like that, so I don't do it. Let's see, Lucy. She did pretty good. She's got a few pepperonis. I don't think she ate any of those, and she didn't eat her chips. Um, we'll see you guys back tomorrow for Thursday. Yeah. All right, everybody, welcome to, what day is it? Thursday. Sorry, there's always noise in the background, but it's real life. Let me show you what the kids have today. So, Nate, I'm doing pizza for him again. I know he had it on Monday, but I have some leftover homemade pizza that really needs to be used up. So, those are just some... One I made at home with some pepperoni and cheese and pizza sauce. So he's got that. I just heated up in the air fryer for just like two or three minutes just to make it warm. It won't be warm at lunch, but it will hopefully still be kind of soft. So he's got that. He's got some Doritos, which are his favorite. Some strawberries and a mixed berry cereal bar. He's going to have milk with that. And then for snack today, he's got these mini alphabet cookies from Aldi and a charcoalberry thin juice. Lucy has a snacky lunch today like usual. <laughs> She's got a string cheese. This is a fruit strip bar from Great Value. It's kind of like a fruit leather. Um, uh, she likes those. She's got a yellow pepper cut up, some barbecue Pringles, some strawberries. For a little treat, she's got a couple of, um, these are chocolate covered grams. What am I trying to say? Chocolate covered graham crackers. <laughs> They're really good. And then um, she's got a juice to have with her lunch. This is the 100% juice fruit punch. For snack today, she's got some iced animal crackers or animal cookies. And then she has a water for her desk. So that's what they have today. And we'll see you guys back when they get home and we'll see how they did. All right, everybody. Let's see how they did. This was not shut, good. Okay, so Nate didn't eat all of his pizza, but he only has a few bites left, so I will still take it. Everything else is gone. That was a lot of food. Um, I told y'all before, but this Hello, not Hello Fresh, <laughs> Bent Go Fresh box, the inside part, the compartments are way deeper than the Bent Go. They're just bigger. It's just set up differently. Like this bottom has a bigger base, um, even though they're almost even. This one's still deeper. Lucy barely ate anything. No wonder she's hungry. She did not eat her fruit strip, not all of her peppers, not her chips. Lucy talks a lot during lunch. I'm almost 100% positive. So she comes home always hungry and eats a big snack for her, her lunch. <laughs> so we'll see you guys back um, tomorrow for Friday. All right, everybody. Welcome to Friday. Yay, we made it to Friday. Let me show you what the kids have. So we did pasta. They love to take pasta on Friday. It's like their favorite thing ever. And it's really easy because we normally just plan to make it like the day before for dinner. And then they get to just, I get to just heat them up leftovers. I did prime their thermoses with boiling hot water, let it sit in there for about 15 minutes with the lid on, dump out the boiling water, put in the hot food, and it stays warm a lot longer. I'm sorry, it's always loud. Um, Nate has some white cheddar shells and cheese. 
He also has a little container of strawberries. Y'all know if you've watched me that I put a little bit of like a paper towel on top of this before I close it. And it keeps a lot of the moisture off the strawberries once they're cut. He's got a milk to go with his lunch. And then for snack today, I gave him a little, there was just a little bit left of Doritos, but I think it's enough. And then he has a Kool-Aid Jammer strawberry kiwi. Lucy has some rainbow pasta, you know, like the tricolor spirals and then I just topped it with a little bit of butter and Parmesan cheese. She has a side here of some fruit. These are grapes and strawberries. She's got some yellow pepper and then this right here if I can pull it out is a chocolate dove with caramel for dessert. They both have their forks and spoons. For snack today she has some mini Chips Ahoy cookies and then she has her Kool-Aid jammer for her lunch. So that is everything, and I'll see you guys back when they get home, and we'll see how they finished off the week. All right, you guys, the kids are home from school, and we're going to show you what how they ate. So Lucy just had a little bit of her fruit left, um, but not hardly anything, and then she ate all of her pasta, and then Nate ate all of his pasta and all of his sides. So anyway, that is great. We had a great week. And hopefully next week will be just as great. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. The bingo boxes will be linked down below. And we hope to see you next time. Please subscribe, like the video, and comment. And we'll see y'all later. Bye, everybody.